and assalamualaikum. My name is Fatin Kamarina binti Zulkifli and I'm from Unimap. So this is my online assessment two in subject PGT 101 Electric Circuit Principle. This video I want to show you how do I solve the RLC circuit. Okay, this is the question. Calculate the value of VC, IL, and the energy stored in the capacitor C and inductor L. The value of R, C, and L determined by comparison of two numbers of C last digit number from your metric number. So, this is my metric number. The bigger number with the value for the R, C and L in the circuit. So the value of R is 7 and C is 5 and L is 5. How to calculate the value of IL and VC? Okay. Before calculate, we have to short circuit at component L and open circuit at component C. And, and then we redraw the circuit. IL is uh, short circuit and VC is uh, open circuit. The formula that I use to calculate IL and VC is Ohm's law. Okay, this is the formula. So IL uh, sama dengan V per R. Uh, so the V is 12 and per 8. So R, R is R total 8. Uh, and the answer is 1.5 ampere. So the VC, uh, we use Ohm's law. So IL uh, is multiplied by R2. Okay, so 1.5 uh, is multiplied by 7. The R2 is 7. So uh, is equal 10.5 um, volt. To calculate the energy that store in the capacitor, we use this formula. 1 per 2 darab dengan C darab dengan V kuasa 2. So, 1 per 2 darab dengan 5 C 5. So, darab dengan 10.5 kuasa 2. So, jawapan ni dapat 275.625 J. Dan the energy that store in the inductor we use this formula so 1 per 2 darab dengan uh, L darab dengan I kuasa 2 so 1 per 2 darab dengan 5 and darab dengan 1.5 kuasa 2 so jawapan dia dapat 5.625 joule show you how to measure IL and VC. Okay, so based on the question, we need to use Tinkercad software. Okay, so to construct and measure the circuit, we have to prepare the component, which is two resistor and one inductor. One capacitor, multimeter, sources, and breadboard.
guys are watching. Thank you for watching.